improve and probably going to be something that uh, maybe a few people have done and all that stuff. And yeah. What happened was I bought this at the Goodwill shop a couple years ago. Below a price three ninety nine. So yeah. And it was originally bought at some store called the Super D for a little price of five ninety nine. Yeah. And all that. And the box could be in better shape, but at least it's in the box. I actually had one similar to this uh, some years ago. Except I kind of used it as a cooling fan in the studio of my old house. Which also is long gone, but has a cat's yelling again. But yeah, I mean, I saw this and I thought, eh, why the heck not? And if you notice on the side, it's got, it draws in, it draws air through an air filtration system, recirculates fresher, cleaner air, energy efficient, quiet motor with an on off switch, cost penny a day, continuous usage, etc. etc. Now, I'm not sure about the replacement filters because with this being so old, you may not be able to find them anymore. Now I can find a copyright date on this. It's right here. Come on, focus. Focus. Focus, thank you. Yeah, copyright North American Phillips Corporation, 1982. So, we may be able to find some. We may not. I don't know. I mean, 30 years is going to be... And if I mean, I could probably find new old stock filters, but they're probably going to be pointless because, well, it'll lose its elasticity. No. It'll lose its potency. That's what I'm talking about. And it's got stuff in a little poly bag, like um, the listing of Norelco service centers, which I'm curious. Any of them here in town? Let's see. Um, oh, look. There's one in Bloomfield, New Jersey. <laughs> oh, and Carol! <laughs> ah, Tennessee. Nope, nowhere in Clarksville. Oh well, not my problem. And here's like a little thing where you can order parts and whatnot. Probably... Mm. Yeah, well, whatever. These will be going back in the little poly bag for future references. Well, probably when I turn old and gray and remember. Remember when stuff was simple to use? Now we just, now we have to have a degree just to check oil. All that stuff. <laughs> Excuse me. I hurt myself. But you probably want to see it in action. And I actually have it unboxed. And we're going to plug it up. And if you notice, it has a little line cord switch. So, and here's a little fan. So, here's on. Yeah, with this filter in the way, you're probably not going to get in the way of... A little better, but and in case you're wondering, here's what the filter looks like. And the other side, where there's a date on it. it. There's not written down, but I figured why not. Now this might be original, but this has been used because yeah, motor's well oiled. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but. These blades are dirty, so this has been used for a time. I don't know how long ago the last was used, but it has been used. There's the thing. And there's a little hook right here, so you can actually put it on a wall and have it circulate air that way. But I just buy it because it's a unique looking fan and all that neat stuff. So that's just my opinion. So I guess I'm going to conclude this video of the Norelco Clean Air Machine Model 
HB0999 as the camera went dark. Guess till next time, I'm going to ask you thanks for watching. And in the comment box is open.